Now, I want to hear your life story in a nutshell, because you were born in Sierra Leone at 10 years old. You moved here to the States. You practiced law for more than a dozen years. So how do you make that transition into becoming a designer? Well, I mean, I've always enjoyed um, clothing, and I've always enjoyed African clothing. So it was a, a pretty much an, a very easy transition in the, in the sense that I was already immersed in that culture. And so I was able to understand how I wanted something to look that was very different from the traditional sense because our stuff is very contemporary and it's a hybrid um, of different things either textiles or um, cultures and that's how we like to like like to um, see the see the brand so I think I was able to because I grew up here in the US but had still my Sierra Leonean heritage was able to do a lot more um, diving into having something more um, contemporary and more Western than I would if I was actually just growing up in Sierra Leone. So <laughs> lovely. That's a great sentiment. Okay, Thank so let's you. bring out our first model, Chase, to check out uh, the look from head to toe. <laughs> Now, the messenger bag is a pretty cool part of this ensemble. Yes, absolutely. You know, Chase has got it going on. He is um, a young CEO at a, at a startup tech firm, and he's just going into work and to start his day. And obviously, we know, like, the, the tech firms of the world these days are very casual. You can show up in a biker jacket if you want. Um, most of them don't wear blazers, but he's got his African print tie on, uh, um, scarf on around his neck, and in then he's got the, the bag. <laughs> exactly and then he's got his messenger bag which is really a, a laptop bag and it's actually part of our Maasai warrior collection and our Maasai warrior collection is basically an ode to the Maasai tribe of East Africa they're um, a nomadic tribe and they use basic they have they have these cloths that are they feel kind of feel like wool but they use it and uh, use them as blankets or as clothing and so we decided to do an ode to that particular tribe so part of our our bags is that we definitely get to do odes to different tribes in different parts of Africa. This so. is a great look because it's polished and professional but Chase Absolutely. it's like you don't take yourself too seriously whatever the startup is I'll buy <laughs> all your products. Um, Chase thank you so much. Lauren come on out our next model and if you're going out for brunch on a breezy Saturday this is a dressed up way to go. Absolutely huh? absolutely you know she's got on her boots obviously because she can. It's a breezy Saturday. Um, we've got the turtleneck underneath, and then we have the House of Takura shift dress um, with the flared sleeves. But she's also going to a spa after, you know, her brunch with her girls. They're going to be a day. Like yes, absolutely. They're going to have a day at the spa. So she's got to pack a few more things than just her purse. So she went ahead and packed her love you back tote you know, um, to pack a few more things for her for her spa date with I'm her girls. I'm sensing a theme here. <laughs> You're not afraid of color and pattern. Not at all, not at all. <laughs> okay, Lauren, you look great. I'll see you at the spa. Our third model, Miranda, come on out. I'm guessing a bit more color. There uh, we go, absolutely. color and patterns. Now, so this is her bag. This is the same print that we saw in Chase's messenger bag. Correct, correct. So this is, again, our ode to the Maasai warrior tribe. And actually, this bag is called our overnighter. Lauren is leaving work. She's headed straight to the airport. She has a business trip, um, a business meeting tomorrow. And so she has to pack a few things in her overnight bag. And we also, the, the, the bag comes with a passport holder because it's, you know, uh, the ode to the nomadic aspect of, of the Maasai warriors. So we Guaranteed actually added. <laughs> nobody else will have that passport cover. Or Absolutely bag not. Not at all. <laughs> okay. And that jacket, um, it has, could you just turn around just for a second so we can see uh, the back, Miranda? Look how, how beautiful that detailing is. And you've incorporated a tie in there too. Absolutely. So the jacket is basically just a trench coat. Um, and it's this, this particular fabric is very popular here in the U.S. It's called the dashiki fabric. Um, back in Africa, some some countries they call it the Angelina fabric. Um, some call it some something else. But this is a fabric that originated in Africa, but was very popular here in the 70s. It's beautiful. Very very popular. Miranda, here. thank you very much. Let's bring out Jasmine. So a lot of women have a little black dress <laughs> in their wardrobe, <laughs> and this little black dress pumped it up with this headscarf and.
and the bag. Yeah, so Jasmine is our fashion editor at High Fashion Magazine. She's super hip, and so she's got her headscarf going on, um, but not tied in a very traditional way. She's kind of used it as a as a headband almost with a little knot at the top. And then she's got the great backpack. It's called the sack pack, which has a compartment not just for you know your items that you need magazine items that you need but it also has a compartment in the back for your laptop that you need and that's a fabric bag uh, absolutely with leather detail. absolutely jasmine you look fantastic and last but not least brielle coming out brielle and looks like she's going on a weekend trip with uh her bag there, her weekend bag. Yeah, so this is one of the, this is a, this is the original bag that started this whole bag collection. It was the Weekender. The OG. <laughs> exactly. A friend of mine asked me, hey, I, can you make me a bag to go on a trip somewhere for just a weekend road trip? And I said, you know what, I can do that. And so we kind of sourced fabric and we decided how she wanted, she, how much space she wanted in it. So we, we started the weekend bag and actually that is, that is our original bag that started this whole traditional bag line. Okay, well, Brielle, <laughs> have a great trip wherever you're going. And uh, the bags, by the way, there is a special Houston Life discount code. If you use the code Secure the Bag, there's the info on your screen right now, the website houseoftakura.com. Now through October 7th, you can get 15% off travel bags using that code Secure the Bag. Annette, thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you so much for having me. Love all the bright colors and the designs. Thanks to all of our models as well. And don't go away, Houston Life will be right back.